What's up guys? Today we're gonna to be reviewing the 18 inch Newark Light. New Newark, New Newark. We're gonna be reviewing the Newark 18 inch ring light. That's almost as long as my. The main reason why I'm doing this product review and unboxing is mainly because I wanna be flexible, especially with me Try and take this YouTube thing seriously now. <clears throat> Made a video about that a while ago. You should probably watch that. Um, go watch that video. Um, I want to be able to shoot during the day and during the night. I don't want to be limited to just a certain time. So I'm deciding to, you know, purchase this thing to hopefully improve this spectacular freaking lighting that you can see right now. Perfect quality. Shot on an iPhone 11 Pro. <laughs> So, anywho, let's get on with this uh, little unboxing bobber, yeah, shall we? All right. Real quick, allow me to show you what I'm exactly working with right now, just so you get a good idea of what to compare. My fancy smancy uh, tripod here that uh, I tactically placed for my uh, little thing right here, my bobber, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, ooh, it's innovative as f and here we are, our two beautiful light sources that I'm using for my video. Oh my God, is that freaking Mickey? So now you seem to know what I'm kind of working with right now. It's not really the best for night videos, though, if you know what I'm saying. Hey, so uh, kind of noticing you noticing me. So uh, what's up? Oh, really? Mm, sounds pretty interesting. Oh, is that, what did you say? Did you say, you want me to unbox you? Oh, I'm unboxing shit out of you. All right, guys, without further ado, finally, we're going to be doing the unboxing. All right, now, let me just, uh, um, it's a little bit hard doing this one-handed. Okay, now I'm getting pissed. Oh yeah? F you. You messed with the wrong person. Stop resisting. Hey guys, so it turns out that the baton actually worked. So anyways, let's see what's inside. Oh, you don't want to end up like this guy, trust me. Oh, you are so lucky. Ooh. Ah. Yeet. All right, guys, and these are all the things that came with the package. Uh, we got like a, a tripod, we got a few filter things. I'm, I'm uh, a little bit still uncertain of what they are. Ring light, stick thing, other small stick thing, two manuals, piece of paper says thanks, and a new word case. I'm gonna skip scenes about how to construct the whole damn thing because I feel like you guys are smart enough to figure it out. Oh, hello. What up, babe? Can I hat. All right, guys, finally, after like five to 10 minutes, I got this thing done. Here's the finished product of everything uh, put together. first time ever owning a thing like this. I never owned another one before, but it definitely feels like a, a budget light. Can't really be prejudiced towards this light, mainly because, you know, I haven't turned it on yet, so I can't really judge it, you know what I mean? It has all the basics as far as adjustments. It goes pretty high up. It looks kind of sturdy. I mean, you can adjust it a little bit later. Okay. All right, guys, right now you are on the tripod. As you can see right now, this is what I am. A sexy man. Okay, this is uh, fluorescent lights, indoor lights, or whatever you wanna call them. Now we're gonna go see what this baby can do. Be right back. I'm gonna have to turn off the lights and then we're gonna do a comparison shot. And we gonna see how this works out. All right, here we go. Thank you. 
can't tell right now because well I'm a stooge and I can't see the video because I'm facing the freaking camera so give me a sec I'm gonna see the video guys I swear to god well if there's one haha -ha. too freaking smart for this world the last clip or the last scene I just saw you a second ago or whatever the lights were pretty harsh I didn't expect it to be that bright and it was just it was just too much I'm learning along with you guys. You needed this thing called a diffuser, which basically makes it a lot less meh. You know what I mean? So I did a little bit of research. I typed in, how do you fix this? Yeah, they showed me a few products and I'm like, I'm shooting a video right now and I, that looks like a simple like sock thing. I don't wanna pay for something so simple. You know what I mean? So I looked around the house and well, this is what I got going on right now. Uh, I'm gonna take you off this thing and I'm gonna show you. Cause I love you. Yeet. In my house, we have this skirt for your bed uh, that we just kind of laying around and uh, we don't really use them. So yeah, so I, I just grabbed it out of the closet and then blammo kaka is what we got going on. <laughs> Buying another product. <laughs> I'm using what I got. I like this lighting a lot more than the previous clip. Yeah, that was that was no no. So pros and cons about this light. My only issue that I have so far with this light, it's really just that I didn't have a mount, but I could always get that uh, online or a little bit separate. I don't mind paying a little bit more for that at least, because right now I'm playing Daredevil with a, basically a thousand dollar phone. I'm just balancing it on it on the ring light right now. I don't. Yeah, if it falls, I'm gonna die. I promise. Because who needs Apple Care? Also, at the fact that it didn't come with the sock thing. I mean, I think there's a package that you can order on Amazon with the sock included or the diffuser. Sorry. And the last thing that I could probably say that's negative about this. I'm assuming it's all ring lights in general that are going to have this problem uh, with glasses. Is that it, you could see the reflection a little bit more, you know, as opposed to just me not having my glasses on, you know? Like, yeah, you can't really notice the light in my eyes as much as this, but I guess it's just the glasses thing, you know? But uh, it's not so bad, you know, being this close to the to the camera, but the more I distance myself, you can, yeah, it's, it's bad. You can't even see anymore. Positives. I like how this, uh, with the diffuser at least, um, it doesn't burn my eyes like I did in the beginning. That's cool. I feel like I'm getting a good amount of light. And right now, I actually think it's on its lowest setting. So actually, just to show you guys, let's see what it looked like with Maximum Perry. Yeah, see, that's how it looked like at its lowest setting without the diffuser. Uh, yeah, this is too much. I mean, it's a little bit too much right now, but imagine without the diffuser, bitch. And I kind of want to see what this looks like at a far distance. For you guys, you know, do shabby cut, but see, there's that glasses thing that I was mentioning. These no gonna fly, these will fly. I am the captain now. Herpes, do you have them or not? Tune in in five minutes, or do you? Let me turn this PC down. Yeah, so you can only imagine what it's like at its full potential. Um, without a diffuser, so verdict. Love it. I think this is a really big improvement as opposed to the lighting that you saw previously because that's a no-no. This is this feels profesh. This feels like fresh, like Subway or something, not sponsored. And this is definitely a big step up for a guy that's trying to get serious about this. Uh, got this thing for 80 bucks or might be a little bit more, something like that. I've left an affiliate link down below if you wanna hook a homie. Oh, I say hook. 
me. <laughs> that is all for this video. Uh, like, share, subscribe, and hit that alert button if you want to see more videos of mine when uh, mine come out. F with me. Oh, hey there. Uh, what's up?